hey guys welcome to my channel and i'm starting this video outright going into my village on deplorable roads you know so this is a, a village travel vlog i'm visiting my grandma's village after seven years and i'm so happy to be back so stay tuned don't forget to like comment and subscribe Okay, we are home so let me show you around that is our bathhouse up there and this is our kitchen and then let me show you a little bit around the village it's a small village so as and when I go out I might show you more but now let's just enjoy the village environment the ambience the trees the greenery and everything I'm going to get my hair done. One of my aunties lived down the road and I didn't see her yesterday, so I'm going there to say good morning. And a motor will come to pick me up to the market spot. And there are some insects here, guys, they've been biting. Can you see? They come early in the morning and then in the evening. I forgot about them today and they've devoured me. <laughs> when I woke up to brush my teeth, I think that was when they actually bit me. Alright, so here I was back from the salon and this is my hair. It turned out good just with the ends. I wanted us to flat iron and cure the ends, but they didn't have a flat iron. So I just kept it like that. Do cook, do cook. Oh, I'm going to do it for the room. Huh? Yeah, I'm going to do it for the room. We are going to the farm. There's my cup of Milo. I woke up late, so they couldn't wait for me to drink. See this? So, 
So today I'm a farm girl. I'm going to farm. This is the school. This is a cassava plantation. When we were kids, when we come on holidays, we will pluck the leaves and we take them to the market to sell. Oh, I miss the good old days. They are leaving you. Oko dia. Oko dia. Let's ah. write up. We are in a cocoa farm. I want to show you some cocoa. Oh, this one has so many pods. This one is ripe. Oh, this one is so nice. Nice. And, um, this is a maize plantation. A dried one. If they are going to sell it dry, they wait for it to dry on the trees before they pick it. This cocoa is valid.
I'm going home. <laughs> I can't stay here. The insects are biting me all over. So I'm I'm going home. I'm done. I'm done farming. I wanted to take the best farm out of this year, but mm -mm, this is not for me. So I'm going home. I'll catch you all later. No, no. Welcome to my usual place in this house. My favorite spot to talk to you guys. So it's it's late evening and it's been raining from mid afternoon. In the morning, you saw me going to the farm. I was eating all over, so I ran home. When I go home, it started raining, so I was lucky I came home. I came to sleep and um i'm up i'm sour i'm going to eat so today tonight is my fourth night in this village and tonight is going to be the third night i eat with you that is what we do here
Good morning. Hi hey guys. It's a new day. My last full day here. And it's a market day, so you'll be going to the market. And maybe to the farm for the last time and then I'll leave tomorrow and then I'll leave tomorrow uh, late morning or in the afternoon. So today we are going to the market. I'm taking you guys along to see a market day in my village. So stay tuned. So welcome to the market square. But first, let's talk a bit about my village. So, this is not my actual hometown, but this is where my grandma lived. May her soul rest in peace. But I never got to ask why she settled here, but we used to come here every Christmas till she passed. And fun fact, I've been to my hometown three times only. So, the name of my village is Bipoise in the Fantiaqua North District in the Eastern Region. And I can say probably 99% of the inhabitants are farmers. And the rest are probably teachers, but they also farm. So, they mostly do farming here. And the main crop that they grow here is cassava. So, you'll be seeing cassava all around which others also convert some into gari to sell on market day like this. So another crop is plantain and you can imagine the combination between cassava and plantain. If you know, you know. They also found yam and pepper. And here we have palm fruit and beans. If you've ever eaten fufu with palm nut soup with beans in it, you know that that food is fire. We also have contumery here, so just name it every kind of crop except rice, that is what I know. We farm everything. I also bought the ball, some potatoes, and some beans to take along with me to the city. This is the next day, the day I was leaving my little village and I decided to show you guys the bad rules over here too. I remember these rules were done seven years ago when I was coming to my grandma's funeral they were newly done, so how come they are no more? It's so insane. So, I enjoyed my stay in the village and I continued to another place, which I will also vlog. So stay tuned for that. Thank you for watching this vlog. And don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And stay tuned for more on this channel.